Adana, Ankara, Antalya, Aydın, Eskişehir, Mersin, Muğla, Tekirdağ, İzmir ve İstanbul'u yeniden kazandık. City after city. As the results came in, it became clear it would be a night of celebration for Turkey's opposition. The main opposition party, the CHP, held on to the mayor's offices in the capital Ankara and the largest city Istanbul and made huge gains elsewhere, including in cities traditionally held by the AK party of President Recep Tayyip Erdogan. Today the voters made a very important decision. The election results show that today the voters decided to establish a new politics in Turkey. Today, the voters decided to change the 22-year-old picture of Turkey and open the door to a new political climate in our country. These municipal elections are widely seen as a referendum on the leadership of the Conservative Erdogan more than two decades into his rule, a decade as Prime Minister and a decade as President. He was re-elected just last year, but confidence in the government has been waning as Turkey struggles with rampant inflation and a cost-of-living crisis. At his party headquarters, Erdogan told a subdued crowd that the election wasn't an end, but a turning point. We will open-heartedly analyse the results within our party and make our self-criticism boldly. However, we will not disrespect our nation's decision in any way. We will avoid being stubborn, acting against the national will, and questioning the judgment of our nation. The opposition was demoralized after losing last year's presidential vote and making a disappointing showing in parliamentary elections. These municipal results bring them a renewed hope that they can change Turkey's political landscape after a generation under Erdogan. Thank <laughs> you.